Hello everyone. So I just, I always like separating my Dollar Tree hauls from my Dollarama hauls. So this is a Dollarama haul and I just posted a Dollar Tree haul. Um, so let's get started. I was really excited to find this and I'm actually going <laughs> to kind of sneak it um, and hide it because this is the original Orb Slimy. So it's the slippery gooey ooey stuff and this is sold at Michael's for I think $8.00. Or nine dollars so my daughter just bought some and actually paid um, with a coupon but still this is four dollars a pack at Dollarama so I thought I'd grab a couple and keep them on hand for when she's looking for slime they love making slime at home but sometimes she likes to have like the real you know store-bought slime and this stuff looks like real well it's a good product because Michaels even carries it it's the orb orb brand so there's that and those were four dollars okay this was one of my exciting finds today my daughter purchased little, I don't think you can see them on me, no, little kitty ears. I would never wear these, but for $15 at Claire's, little kitty ears just like this, maybe they were turquoise or a different color, for $15. These were $1 at Dollarama today. So there's the pink, the black, and then I got her some sparkly silver looks like a crushed you can kind of see that it's crushed right for three dollars she's got cute three little and she can't even find the other ones I don't know if she's misplaced them but anyways what a score what a deal what a deal so there's that I purchased some Pantene shampoo for my son and um, it's 595 mils there's no price tag on it because Dollarama is now putting all the prices along the front shelf so you have to be very careful where the products are. This smells so nice. It's $4. This was $4. I purchased some. I love this stuff. It's probably not the best, but I love the smell. It reminds me of my childhood, I think. Hawaiian Tropics or Hawaiian Tropics Sheer Touch Oil Free Sunscreen SPF 45. It has, um, I don't know, is it waterproof? Probably not. Anyways, it smells so good. Who loves the certain sunscreen smells? This is one of my favorite. I don't know if it smells like coconuts or something, but this reminds me of Florida all the time. Mm. Anyways, 45, and I need it. I need to protect my skin. As I'm getting older, all my spots are coming out, and it's just ah, uh, scary stuff. Okay, the fun part, craft goodies. So I purchased these sweet little clips. Look at that. They go with all the cacti theme. How cute are these? And for $1.25, I couldn't even make these if I wanted to. Look at this one. It has like a little penguin sitting. He's so cute. So there's that. I had to purchase some more of these. I love them. They're so versatile in pocket letters. There's four in a pack. And these are $1.25 as well. And they're just lace and pretty and they have this pretty little pearl and you can add things to it if you want but I just love the print. I purchased one of these little mini staplers for a dollar fifty. My friend um, in my in my little pocket I think is the name of her Instagram account she suggested p picking up one of these little mini staplers because they're not the standard size so when I'm doing little embellishments maybe I can get the look we're looking for with this one so I'm willing to try it out can't go wrong because the industrial ones are like 30 bucks at Michael's so I was so excited to find these little wooden spools so they're $1.50 for the little ones that are nine I wish they were smaller but still I can I can manage with this and then there are six pieces of the larger ones now the shape is a little bit different as you can see there were different options this one here is more like slanted and this one is more traditional I look forward to doing some cute little craft stuff with this so stick around to the channel to see what I do with them and then I purchased this a beautiful coloring book not that I need any more coloring books I have plenty but for three dollars I couldn't pass this up I almost should have bought two and unfortunately when I did go to another Dollarama as I was driving home they didn't have any of these so I do regret not purchasing two I should probably go back but then again one will do but look how beautiful and the pages are so nice and thick they're not like that 
yeah, like just really, really nice quality book. So for the winter months, maybe this will be something. Can always be part of a gift or something like that as well with a beautiful pack of pencil crowns. And then I was really, I held back from the ribbon. I've been going a little bit ribbon crazy lately and I, I don't know why because I never used to be a ribbon girl, but all of a sudden my ribbons are a little bit out of control. However, I couldn't pass up this pattern. They did have different colors. They had white, they had gold, um, silver, I believe. And I had to have this navy blue. I'm just going to open this up for you guys to show you. So, sorry. I am just loving navy blue right now. And look at this. This beautiful, you probably can see it there. It's not pretty. It's so pretty. So I'm looking forward to using that. And this was a dollar fifty. And I mean, there's quite a bit for what I needed to need to do with it. Cause it's just always small projects, like little paper projects and stuff. But I hope to incorporate that into a pocket letter. And then I had to purchase this. I've held back on this decorative rhinestone mesh for so long. I have one of the other rolls with all the different, there's the round and the square and all sorts of different shapes on it. But this one here, I had to have it today. I don't know why, but it has all these little squares. And of course I cut them and then use them as embellishments. But for $2, I mean, this stuff will last me a lifetime. I can even share some, I can cut some and send it off in a pocket letter at the back. And if I use it on the front pocket, somebody will then say, hey, she cut that mesh up and used it as little accents. So it'll give you an idea as well as how I've used it. So that was another fabulous, fabulous price value find for yourself and also to share with friends. And then these little cut rhinestones, I've passed up on them for quite some time. They're $2 and they come in a little, what is going on with my lighting today? They come in this little container and they're made by this company, the Crafts Company. And they're just beautiful little rhinestones and again I'm just planning on using them as little embellishments you know what I'll do is I will um, I'll open I'll take you a video and show you guys what they look like because it's probably hard to see but aren't they gorgeous just gorgeous so there's outside chasing the birds he I don't know if it's just we used to have a big giant chocolate lab and she was the most gentle giant ever. Like she could care less if a bird was out there. Like she would share the space and everything with the world, with nature. He has this mentality that he's the only one allowed to live. Like everything else has to die. And he gets upset. He's like, Grr, grumbles at them and growls at them. Well, not really growls, but he makes like this weird bark sound. And I'm like, it's okay. Other things are allowed to live there. You're not the only one on the earth. But, and we have a chipmunk that lives here. You guys have probably seen him in one of my videos where Bear is ready to kill him. And I'm like, you need to share the premises with Alvin. Alvin has been here longer than you. And he's a regular, like just his family has been living on our property for so long. So anyways, he's got to learn to share. And if you have another little animal like my bear, Please let me know. His name suits him so perfectly. He is such a bear. He's a grizzly bear, grumbly bear, grumpy bear, and a happy bear. Cuddly bear. He is all those things that come with a bear. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my small Dollarama haul for today. And until the next video, everyone, have a wonderful one. Bye for now.